okay so in this video i will show you how to uh, create a selenium project with java using uh, maven to, for managing dependencies uh, and we will be using the intellij ide that is opened up in front of me so uh, to get intellij ide if you don't have it installed already just go to jetbrains uh, site and uh, according to your operating system that you're using just scroll down and uh, download the community edition because it's free and it's open source so uh once you've done that and installed that um you should see the screen and here we can go ahead and create a new project so uh we'll keep the project selected as java and uh, to name my project uh, i will just give it a name and uh, i'll keep the location as it is as uh, this is the lo location where i want uh, my project to be created and for the build system uh, i will uh, select maven over here because uh, we'll be using maven to uh, manage our dependencies and jdk here i have uh, jdk 22 selected um, the jdk version shown here will be according to your system whatever jdk version you have installed so it will be able to detect it or if you want to download a jdk you can download it from here as well so yeah let's go ahead and create this project So yeah, my new project has been created and set up and uh, this file that is opened right in front of me is pom.xml. This is a very important file in Maven as uh, we will be adding dependencies in this file. So um, let's go ahead and uh, add a dependency for Selenium Java. So just simply go to Google and search for Selenium Java Maven dependency. And here in the Maven repository, um, the latest version as of now is 4.20. So let's go ahead and select that. And uh, for the Maven, Maven dependency, let's go ahead and um, copy this. And uh, before pasting it over here, let me add the dependencies tag. And then I will be able to paste it over here. So uh, I've added the Selenium Java dependencies. So uh, in case you see this text in red, and if you see the error that uh, dependency is not resolved, just uh, right click and uh, select uh, Maven and reload this project. So what that would do is uh, resolve this error if you're facing this. So now that we have a Selenium Java dependency added here, let's go ahead and uh, write our first test and uh, will not be really doing anything just setting up the driver class and navigating to a url so let's uh, create a new java class and just test the setup so uh, i'll be creating a main method over here since i don't have any testing uh, framework set up i can't use any test annotations so to be able to run this file i will need to add a main method And here I just need two lines of code. The first will be uh, I will be creating a driver object for the web driver class and uh, initializing uh, any driver. So if I want Chrome driver, I can initialize Chrome driver or Firefox driver. So let's go ahead for, for Chrome driver and that should add the Chrome driver for us. And um, it says that cannot resolve a simple web driver. Let's simply import this class. So all the issues have been resolved and then the next line would simply be to to navigate to the url so for that we just need to uh, use a method driver.get and uh, let's give it any url so for instance i want to navigate to this site and uh, that's literally it so just let's go ahead and run this file So yeah, uh, using the Chrome driver, web driver, I've been able to navigate to this site. So that's it for this video. I hope you liked this video and it was easy to follow. If in case you faced any issue with the setup, you can comment down below and I'll try my best to resolve your issue.